What the hell? It can't be that high. How can it be that high? What the heck? I didn't even eat anything. So Foodie's done a live first thing in the morning. I think she said it's like 4.30 there. And I've no idea why it's still up in all honesty. Um, it's her testing her blood and finding out the result and then freaking everyone out. So I will obviously cut this down as much as I can and show you the important bits. Let's go. Hey, babe. You're first. I have to take my medications. The topic for today is just talking to you guys. <clears throat> I have four more antibiotics to take. What, like, it's like, which year and they still haven't figured out how to make antibiotics small? This is a person that still can't figure out how to make herself small. Pot kettle black much? <coughs> hi, golden girl. Hello, nice to see you. Um, well, hi, pink stars. I'm feeling okay. Like, I, I'm a bit, like, uh, congested because I just got up not long ago, but... Hi, Joanne. I'm gonna take my inhaler <coughs> when I get up. Oh, Prince Eric, hi! It's been a while! Happy birthday, I, I hope you liked your cameo. <laughs> hi Eric, I have a very special cameo message for you from myself and Patricia, and it's a birthday message, so I want to wish you a happy birthday. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Eric, happy birthday to you, and many more. And also that um, there's a message that uh, you've been such a wonderful, good son for taking care of your father, and you deserve a wonderful year to come. So I wish you all the best. And I sadly heard that Meoweth passed away, and I don't want to bring up something traumatic like that, but I just want you to know that um, you're in my thoughts and prayers because Meoweth was special to me too. I remember that cat, and I remember you well, and I really appreciate you being a fan through everything. And um, I'm sure Meoweth is over the Rainbow Bridge and somewhere um special being taken care of so don't worry about that um and i'm really sorry again to hear that and i really wish you a wonderful birthday have lots of wonderful birthday cake and thanks for the support with a cameo and thank you for you know supporting me for all these years it really means a lot so take care eric thank you so much and i'll see you soon bye so basically my husband's left me in the car again and i had nothing better to do so i thought i'd do this cameo to make a little bit of money because i'm not making money anywhere else i know you don't want to talk about your dead cat but i'm gonna bring it up love you bye i'm sorry to hear about meow with hi bella your picture <laughs> hi anna <laughs> hello michelle you took your wagovi and now you're nauseous Aw, you got stung by a bee i shot it on santa's knee i can't say turkey tree i'm just having a pee between your eyebrows <gasps> no golden girl dang i don't know if i can show this on here look at that knuckle cleavage oh my goodness voluptuous oh are you okay you're not allergic or anything i hope still that's ouch oh my gosh that's the worst place hey ghost face i don't know why i do this all on camera but why not i have nothing else to do and there we have it folks it doesn't happen very often but she's actually just told the truth she has nothing better to do on a live than just take tablets and talk about absolutely nothing mm. so hey miss uh, Helleth Razor. Beezer got buzzed on. Yeah. I can hardly see my... Oh, no. Did you see a doctor? Like, when did they think... Did they give you something for the swelling, at least? What the heck? That's a crazy... Pl a bee just flew on your face? That's insane. I hope you get better soon. West Coast. I don't know what you look like when you just wake up. If you wake up and start doing the mashed potato all over your house. But I don't... I'm not too lively when I just get up. Seems like somebody's hug box isn't too friendly this morning. Got a new thing here. I got a new machine. <coughs> Hi, Scrape Goat. Okay, I think I'm good. I'm not too lively at any time of the day. <laughs> hey, Mama from Iowa. I'm not in a bad mood. I'm just saying West Coast last. <laughs> what the heck? So I have... I'm not turning the light on right now. I'm too tired. I have a uh, thing here. On-call blood glucose monitoring system. Greetings. <laughs> and it comes with the machine. And, whoa, cool. I wish I didn't have to have this, but. Okay, so it comes with this pouch, this little thing. I don't know what that is for. All of these are lancets, and all of these are strips, so 100 each. And the lancer and the machine. No roach, it's called being fat. That's what causes the face swelling. Uh, you can reverse insulin resistance by, I don't know if you, you can cure diabetes, but you can reverse insulin resistance by 
proper diet and exercise. Yeah, you can. Oh my god! 5.8. That's totally normal. Hey. I swear. 5.8. That's a normal blood sugar. My blood sugar levels being at a normal fasting. It used to be a fasting was like at 10, at least. 10, 11. Eggplant every day keeps the diabetes away. Yes, it does! I have no more diabetes. I have no more diabetes. I have no more diabetes. Goodbye, diabetes. Goodbye. You ate so much sugar, your diabetes got, got diabetes and died. <laughs> How did I cure my diabetes by eating 50 lakma? Can anyone tell me? Is your blood sugar higher when you just wake up? Maybe my sugar will be higher right now. Should I test it? I can try it. Rich Lux, no way. What's going on? As if you're in my chat. Hello. <laughs> Rich Lux, yes. It's so random. What the heck? <laughs> welcome, welcome to the Beezer show. Yeah, I think the last time um, you sent me a box with like, hey Angela, some cool glasses and a mirror and stuff. I don't know where the glasses are. I'm so, ugh. I could use those now. <sighs> Anyways, yeah. Okay, who wants to test my blood sugar <coughs> before I eat a plum? <laughs> I don't know, I'll probably always have this chipmunk face. What is this for? Oh, they give you alcohol. I don't have to wash my hands. I'm just joking. <laughs> they give you alcohol swabs, nice. What the hell? It can't be that high. How can it be that high? What the heck? I didn't even eat anything. It says 21. <laughs> you people seeing this would be right to feel concerned. I'm not wasting my time on being concerned about you when I know that you'll quite happily go to the hospital and get a takeaway on the way back. Do not waste your sympathy on this woman. She will throw it back in your face. Uh, which I have to go take my medication now. <laughs> That's high. That's really high. I'm just not going to eat anything. Even when I don't eat anything. What the heck? Wait a minute. So eating healthier for a week isn't going to cure a morbidly obese diabetic that's taken 30 plus years to do this amount of damage to her body. You're joking. Maybe I have to go on insulin. I don't know. <sighs> Take it again in a few hours. I, I ate like, um, yeah, I am. When did I eat last? Like 5 p.m. And it's 4.30 a.m. Hi guys, it's Dr. Lunchy here with a Masters in Google and I just had a look at a chart that I really would like you to see. I don't know how this is possible, but Foodie's in the level higher than Deathly. She's in the unaliving level, the highest level. Your blood sugar should be lowest after fasting. This is genuinely terrifying. That can't be right. That's weird. I don't know, maybe I'm still sick, I don't know. She's once again not living in the real world. She's trying to find any reason that her reading would be that, apart from the fact that she's abused her body for so long. Or maybe the antibiotics, I don't know. No, Caroline, I haven't been really good with my medication. I'm doing my best to not get too sassy here, as Vidi would say, but is she actually taking the piss? She's got this privilege of being able to have access to diabetes medication and she's still not doing it. She's still so deluded. She's lost this tiny bit of weight that she keeps telling everyone about and she's just got it in her head that she's right and everybody else is wrong. You don't have enough time to mess about like this. I want to wait to see the doctor again so I can like make sure that like, you know, that's what I should be on, but I definitely should go take a pill right now. Anyways, yeah, that's really high. I don't know. Well, I washed my hands, but then I had like a, there's like fruit, there's like watermelon residue on the table, but I used the thing. I don't know. I'm confused. I mean, I feel okay. I don't feel dizzy or anything. You've spent the last week saying that this is the illest you've ever felt. Just because you feel okay now, it doesn't mean it's going to stay that way. You are proof of that. <laughs> the normal is between, I know, babe, it's bad. It's like discouraging because I lost weight. I guess that doesn't have anything to do with diabetes in a way, does it? Maybe like zero sugar, like I shouldn't have any fruit at all. Yeah, it's MMOL. I didn't drink any fruit juice because the fruit juice I bought, I was like, I thought it said no sugar added, but when I drank it, it was still sweet. So that's, that was it, I had like a sip, but I've been eating a lot of fruit. Yeah, I've been eating like plums, peaches. Hey foodie, let me tell you a secret. Google is free. You really should be using it. At least do that. If I can find out in five seconds what a high glucose level is, then you can find out whether you should be eating fruit or not when you have diabetes. Death does not care about your delusion. Hey, teardrop. <sighs> I can't get Ozempic here. It's out of the question. So no, no Ozempic, no Manjaro, nothing. So it would have to be like, you know, but all, I'm going to try. I'm just going to take my meds consistently and see and see the doctor about it. No sugar added is full of sugar. Yeah. Well, it's natural sugar, but it's still sugar. Yeah. 
<laughs> That's not good. It goes over 20 to call 911 immediately. I feel fine. I'm going to go back to the doctor that was looking over me and prescribed me the medication I'm, I'm to take. Is that really Pete's? I don't think it would be Pete's. Is that really Pete's? Someone check because I'm not saying hi to a fake Pete's. Pete's, is that you? Can anyone check? I don't know. Um, if it's you, um, it's you. Okay. Hi, Pete's! Wow, you've never, like, ever come into one of my streams. <laughs> Welcome. Listen to fake Pete's. It's really him. It's real. Okay, okay. I gotta take my meds, but I usually have to take them with something to eat, and I'm not hungry. I want to eat this plum. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> it was like a wrapper from the thing. I can't eat plums. This has to be a troll. Okay, Rich Lux and Pete's randomly in my chat at... 444. Babe, 444! Okay, I should, what, go wash my hands and do another test? I don't get it. I don't want to do another test. <laughs> she can't be bothered to do another test, even when it's like a life or death situation. Why am I not surprised? I hate diabetes. Oh, he's on live on his channel? Oh, he's raiding my channel with his live. We should definitely retest. Yeah, Rosemary's baby's mama. Hello, Pete's chat. <laughs> no, Tia, I didn't, I swear I didn't eat a since... Um, comic rock, yay, beauty raid. <laughs> I didn't know you, you could raid uh, YouTube chats. Hey, Gabriel. <laughs> That's funny, Desert Rose. Okay, uh, I don't know what to do. Oh yeah, since last night. Like, um, when did you, when did I eat? Not eat, like, when did I eat? Yeah, about 6 p.m. Between 5 and 6, somewhere like that. Mm. So, that is really high. Maybe that's why I'm so tired all the time. Okay, in any case, what I need to do is, yeah, let's cut up the fruit for now. I'm not nauseous at all anymore. That's why I'm feeling a lot better. So I thought, oh, okay, I'm gonna test like, and I'm not, I don't wanna test my blood until like two hours after I eat something. And like when I'm fasting, right? So I woke up, so I should be fasting. No, I'm not gonna eat something and test, you have to wait two hours. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna go wash my hands. You know what, this is my karma. Do you remember I made fun of those, those women at my work for me talking about their diabetes all day? All right, let's try. Wash hand with soap. This is concerning. What the hell? Twenty-two? No, that can't be right. What the hell? Twenty-two point six. That's insane. I don't know. But it's been high like that before. When it comes to your health, many of us are lucky with the fact that we actually get like a pre-warning, like little warnings like this to say, look, you need to change something. A lot of people don't get pre-warnings. Unfortunately, you have got your fair share of warnings and you are not changing. What has to happen? Do you genuinely have to have something amputated before you're like, no, this is actually serious and it's happening to me? Do something. Blood sugars go high when ill. That is why DKA usually happens when sick. Okay, I'm just going to take my medication and... See what happens in like a couple days. But I'm, I'm gonna see a doctor. <laughs> I didn't eat. Maybe the device is wrong. I did. I just, just washed my hands with soap. But anyway, I don't know why I do this live. <laughs> Get everyone all upset. Nobody believes for a second that that's not the reason that you did this. You've wanted attention, you know your views are low, you want people to watch you and to send you money and to feel sorry for you. <laughs> Let's just, I don't know if it's accurate, honestly. So the first reading was probably because you're taking antibiotics and it's given a weird reading. And now it's because the machine's faulty. Is there any chance it could just be an actual proper reading and you're seriously in trouble? <laughs> Does it really feel okay? I'm fine. Desert Rose has commented a lot on Foodie's posts and they have all been genuinely like heartfelt, I want you to get better, here's what you can do, this is what I know. And she said that she's medically trained, obviously we never really know, but she does seem like she cares and like she knows what she's talking about. And once again, somebody is caring about Foodie and it's being thrown in their face. Yeah, I'm just gonna drink water for now and, but yeah. I'm not calling an ambulance, I'm okay. Oh, it's a battery operated one. Yeah, MMOL. I don't feel any different. I feel fine. Like, than every day. <laughs> but like a bit, like, I'm always a bit tired, but I don't know. Yeah, that's fasting. But I, I'm going to see a doctor anyways. For sure. Test the law. <laughs> Babe, do you want me to test you to see if it works? I think it's accurate. I probably just have really, really out of whack sugar because I've been eating a lot of fruit and um, I'm still sick, kind of, you know? 
So now she's still sick because that will fit in with what she wants people to think, even though she said at the start of the video that she's pretty much better. Funny that. But anyway, I'm, don't worry, I'm going to see a doctor about it. That's really high, yeah. I'll test it out in a few hours. I took my medication, so. Imagine speaking to your mate and your mate's like, oh my God, I took the pill and I still got pregnant. I can't believe it. And you're like, did you remember to take it every day? They're like, no, oh no, I, I you know, kind of took it here and then. Like, oh, okay. But they're like, oh, but I did take the pill on the day that I had. So I don't know how I've got pregnant. That's how ridiculous you sound. Oh, you're still here, Pete. <laughs> okay, enjoy your stream, Pete. Thanks for stopping by. I know, Millie, I know. I didn't think it would be that high. Like, what the fuck? That's crazy. I'm not going to the ER. Nobody can make me do anything. And there we go. That's Chantal in a nutshell, isn't it? You can't make me do it. Even if it's good for me and you're trying to help me, I'm only going to do it when I want to do it. I haven't had that fruity taste in a long time in my mouth. Like, I'm feeling okay. Like, I feel normal. I don't know. Yeah, lots of sugar, I know. I have to be really, really, really strict. Really stricter. More strict. Strict. Because I'm just, like, equating, like, oh, I lost 15 kg. I'm eating natural food. But I guess when you're insulin resistant, you can't just, you know. Well, yeah, of course. Yeah, if I start feeling worse or whatever. I'm going to see a doctor anyways about it, so. I don't think they have house call doctors. I don't know. <laughs> That's stupid. I'm, I'm so annoyed with myself. I don't take my medication regularly, I'm just gonna be honest, like, I'm stupid. You know? And every time I go see a doctor, they're like, I, you know, my, they see my blood sugars, like the last time I went, the one time I went to see the doctor was 23. You're gonna come test? Okay, babe, wash your hands. They always just keep, they don't put me on insulin, they just put me on these pills, which I should take. Oh, I don't want diabetes. Okay, I'll prepare a needle for so long. He should be normal between, what, five and six? Four, four and six, something like that. I don't think he's eaten in a while either, so his is probably lower. Yeah, honeydews. Melons are very sweet. I've been eating watermelon. So it's probably my fault. It's obviously my fault. Let's change subject. Yeah, I don't know why I did that live. I don't know why. Now it's gonna like be this big uproar. <clears throat> I didn't think it would be high. Like, I really, like, it's eye-opening that, like, once you have diabetes, it's like it doesn't like you, you have to get it under control. Like, like it doesn't matter. Like, like I have to eat like basically like zero, zero, zero. You know. I'm genuinely speechless at how ridiculous she sounds. She does this every few months. She pretends that her diabetes is gone just because she's got a good blood sugar every now and then, and she's so shocked when that's not the case. Hi, Lindsay. Hi, Lindsay. Hi, babe. Can I test my blood? Yeah. Okay. You are ready? This, uh, it was so weird how it's uh, jumped from 21 to 22 within only 10 minutes between. You'll all be very happy to know that Salah doesn't actually come on camera. I know. <coughs> okay. Which hand? Any Choose hand. One. Okay. Left. No, no, not that finger. This. Yeah, this one. Right. <laughs> it's just better. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna put a strip inside. It's gonna be a little kick, okay, babe? It's okay. My face worst. Okay, let me see. That's it? Yeah, but you, you don't have blood coming out. What? <laughs> My blood freezing or what? Wait, I gotta squeeze it more. See if this will do it. I don't think it's enough. No, nope. I gotta pick you harder. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, leave yeah, it like that. Yeah, that's good. No, that's not enough. Blood. I gotta make the needle bigger. Okay. Where's my blood? <laughs> I, I just want to send the email for my blood, maybe, so it can't come out. I've had smear tests more enjoyable than this. Just please shut the fuck up, Salah. Maybe from, I don't know why. Maybe the medications I'm on. I don't know. Give me a second, kid. Does that hurt you? Hmm? Did it hurt you? No, it's all. <laughs> Anastasia, I wish I can be a robot, you know? Technology. Yeah. Okay, um, under strip. Oh, come on. Okay. Don't, don't drink enough water, sir. How come it's not picking you? I don't get it. I have no blood. But, oh, but how am I alive? <laughs> hey, my finger is numb now. <laughs> I'm not getting any blood from you. Yeah, huh? I can't see blood. This one. It's not enough. Why? It's not enough. It won't be enough for the machine. Oh, there we go. Wait, wait. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay. It's coming out. <laughs> All right. So that's blood. Five. Perfect. Like, oh. perfect. <laughs> Is it normal? <laughs> it's normal. Is it vanilla? <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. So the machine's okay. working. Uh, take an alcohol swab here, babe. Okay, but I'm worrying about you now. So the machine's working very well. There's no mistake. Maybe you should have been worrying when you were bringing back takeaways like one or two times every day for the past however many months. That would have probably been the point to start worrying. Yeah. What the heck? I have very high blood sugar. What do you feel about your body now? You I feel okay. I took a pill. I'm going to wait like um, a couple hours, take my blood again. Mm -hmm. I'm just up. 
maybe the medication, the antibiotics, I don't know, I'm still sick. This is exactly the same as when she says, oh, people always talk about me and react to me and are horrible to me because they're jealous of me. Oh, I'm not ill because I've done something to my body. It's obviously the machine did it or the medication did it. Like, you're so deluded. It's never your fault. And we'll see. But yeah, I have to follow up with the doctor eventually there. Like, what he will say? Yeah, he, uh, take a medication? <laughs> Obviously, you should take your medication. Yeah, because uh, last time he said that, and you must just <laughs> focus on your medication. And... Yeah. I, I don't think that, that we need the insulin, right? I'm sorry, Dr. Salah. How would you know that? Are you a doctor? No, you're not. Shut up. You didn't the, think this so. This is for the next level. Yeah, but if it's not going to go down, then yeah. Mm. So. <clears throat> but that's perfect. Five? That's what I want. <laughs> Uh, so I'm five. I'm normal. Yeah, you're normal. I wish I can uh, get your result uh, and give it to me, and you take my result for you. Yeah. Like you take Switch? my five. No, I wouldn't want that on you. And I, oh I take your twenty-two. Aww. Just to, like <laughs> at least you feel okay. <laughs> Thanks, babe. I feel fine, guys. I'm not like you know. Normally you would be dizzy, and so here's the thing. What I'm gonna do is like um, drink lots of water, lay off any fruit. Um, if in a couple hours, like, it doesn't go down, I'm going to go to see the doctor. How, how you say that uh, she look rough? There's no lights. Look. She's happy. <laughs> <laughs> I look okay. Yeah, it's a dangerous level, I know. I know you guys are making it worse. I don't know why I took my blood on live stream. I'm stupid. I don't want to worry you guys. She could not give a f about worrying her followers. She's gutted because she's now getting advice and people telling her that she should be worried. And she doesn't like it. She doesn't like being told that she's bad. She wants hugs in her hug box. Don't worry, I'm going to take care of it. It's like, I really um, didn't take my medication like regularly like I should be because it really, really upsets my stomach. But if I have to take it, I have to take it. So I think it maybe will go away after a month or so. I don't know. You have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. You're just trying to say anything to brush it off. Whereas everybody in that chat knows that this is really dangerous. And you're just like, yeah, well, you know, if something happens, it happens. You know you can only die once, yeah? Anyways. You okay. the number go up when you eat something, but you didn't eat, right? Until now. Nope, I haven't eaten since the when the Jerish yesterday. Mm. But like yesterday afternoon. Mm. But that might be very high in carbs, Jerish. No it, way. It's wheat. It's made with crushed wheat. I'm gonna continue my meds and um, follow up and yeah, I'm just done. If you feel that you wanna go to the clinic or hospital, just tell me, Adi. Yeah, I, I know. Go. Like you can feel your body, your own yeah. body. I just took a pill, yeah. I took a pill. So, hopefully that will... Uh, I really didn't expect it to be that high, that's why either. I'm just like, oh yeah, let's test her blood sugar. <laughs> I'm like, what the freak? She checked it twice, so I need to check three times. Uh, the reader is working very well. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go and plan like a... I have to replan everything I'm like, like eat putting in my body, you know? Because not eating doesn't help, clearly. I didn't eat since yesterday at five. If anything, it might make things worse. I don't know how it raises your blood sugar not to eat. Yeah, Millie said stress can raise blood sugar and you all stressing here and freak out. <laughs> yeah. Just chill down. Come, come down. Yeah. She only became stressed out after she took her blood sugar, so that's completely irrelevant. It's true, yeah. Just send her any positive comments. It's my fault to test it on live stream. I'm stupid. There's a big difference between something like someone concerned or worry and someone sending the negative vibes. It's wrong. The last time people were nice to her and were giving her good comments, they got told to basically f off. So I don't think she'll be getting very many of those anymore. They don't seem to help anyways, do they? Let's be honest. Yeah. We're trying to help you here, not to uh, increase the, <laughs> the heart level and, and stress. Green, yeah, just vegetables and lean protein. That's all I'm going to be eating. <clears throat> okay, guys, I'm going to go rest a bit. And if, if I'm going to test in like a couple hours, like two hours, if it's not, then I will get medical attention. If I feel worse in the meantime, like if I start feeling dizzy, like Salah knows what to look for. Like, you know, if I'm out of it, whatever, you know. No, I'm not, it's not driving me away. I'm just, uh, I just want to go rest. Like, I'm a bit freaked out. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know, like for real, I'm laughing, but I'm like actually freaked out a bit. Like, I don't know, but I didn't expect it to be that high. That's crazy. I'll be back later. I'll come back later and update you guys. Let's see. Yes, Colin, Salah is there for you. Don't worry. I'm here for you. Thanks, babe. Because if my if my numbers don't go down, like natural, like with what I'm doing throughout, you know, the next couple of hours or whatever, um, then I might need like insulin, a bit of insulin. I don't know. I'll have to see a doctor about it. And suddenly too many people just turn to be a doctors and professors, you know? <laughs> Well, a lot of people have diabetes, I'm sure, like, you know, that's the thing. It's very, very common and it's very dangerous. Yeah, I know. If you feel that you want to go to the hospital, I will take you now, okay? Yeah, I know, babe. Don't be hesitate or something. Okay, so don't hesitate if you want to go to the hospital. I'm on Thanks, it, yeah. Thanks, babe. <laughs> Thanks, babe. So I'm going to go take care of myself and I'll see you guys after with an update, okay? Bye! 
So this live was six hours ago as I'm posting this and there's still no update. I don't know what's going to happen if she'll actually go to the hospital or not. Who knows with her? Um, hopefully she'll actually think about others and at least keep people in the loop. I think it's terrifying. I, I can't imagine being her, but this seems to be a regular occurrence. So I'm sure she'll just, you know, forget about it as soon as she's hungry again. Anyways, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching the video. And you know how much I like really appreciate and love you all. You've just been amazing. So I will speak to you all in the next video. Bye.